Hey, welcome to this quick unboxing. Uh, this is Set a Watch, and it showed up on my doorstep this morning. I wasn't expecting it. I uh, somehow missed the email uh, tracking number. So anyway, I backed this back in October and forgot about it. Um, and I really backed it because I liked the creator's other game, uh, Maximum Apocalypse. And then I saw this. It looked like it'd be a good one-player game. Uh, they call it a puzzle, puzzle adventure game. To me, it looked sort of like a mishmash of puzzle, resource management, tower defense, all kind of blended in one. And the big thing was it looked like it was solo, and I really liked uh, the guy's other game, so I thought I'd give it a whirl. Um, but anyway, this is just going to be a quick look at what is inside the Set of Watch Deluxe Edition. Um, hopefully the uh, glare will go away once I get this plastic off. But um, I actually don't even remember what's supposed to be in the box. Um, but so this is the deluxe slip cover. It actually, sorry, the glare's a little better. Um, it's kind of a, uh, it's a nice box. I like it. And then here's the actual game itself. Set a watch. Um, map is part of the box lid, so um, I guess that saves room. Uh, here's the campfire that you have to protect and keep the fire going every night as you go to multiple locations. Um, uh, rule book, it's readable, thank goodness. It's not teeny tiny print. Um, so, gives you your adventurers, a glossary, and a quick reference on the back. Um, eight-sided dice for the some of the characters use eight-sided dice. Um, fairly standard. Uh, some of the characters roll six-sided dice. Um, I think this was one of the de deluxe upgrades, was having the, the wooden tokens here. Um, so here's your fire tokens. Um, and I guess you're camping. I'll have to read the instructions and know how to use each of these. Um, character cards. So they're quite readable, which is important as I've gotten older. <laughs> um, and, and the art is good. Um, so these are these must these are the characters' uh, abilities. Uh, here, are the other cards. I'm just going to go ahead and open them all up if I can find the edge. See where it's supposed to be. So, again, sort of a similar, not cartoony, but not too dire, uh, kind of dark artwork, but you know, appropriate to the theme. Uh, location cards, I guess. Uh, if I remember correctly, you have to go to a bunch of locations and defend your fire and do some actions, and then. Uh, then you fight a big bad guy at, at the end, um, and then these are your your actual creature cards. In the picture, they all have the same back. Um, I guess I'll probably end up sleeving these, uh, and then more cards. Um, I guess these are different abilities. Oh, no, maybe these are... I guess would be these are the Stretch Goal Deluxe uh, cards, and that's why they're packaged differently. Um, so, stack there. It's on Kickstarter. I guess I will go back and look. Um, some extra uh, packaging. Uh, some more. These must be the Kickstarter additional 
uh, abilities cards. And then the night was a Kickstarter uh, deluxe uh, character. So let so me pull this out. Oh, I guess the bard was too. I forgot. I didn't realize that. Um, so this is where you have put their ability cards on. I guess these are dice rolls. Give this die. It's okay. So has their characters. And again, if I remember correctly, you have all your characters lined up uh, in a big row, and you have to fight through the monsters and manage your resources and manage your characters. Um, and then a quick reference of the things they can do. And I think. That's these are just the rest of the characters. And Horde are the monsters that are coming. Unused locations. That's kind of an interesting use. I haven't seen the box used quite this way before. Um, I guess Tiny Epic Tactics is going to do something similar uh, using the box. So anyway, that is everything in this box. I can't wait to actually try the game out. Um, hopefully I will like it as much as I like Maximum Apocalypse. Um, from the same company and that is everything and at some point maybe I will do a review of how well it plays so hey until next time happy gaming